So I just got the question today, should I do a 1031 tax deferred exchange? And just to give you a little context, the person I was speaking with owns a property out of state in another resort town, but it's much further from her home. So it's actually double the distance from her home to the current property she owns as to what it would be here in our resort market. The simple fact is she's owned it for 25 years and has a couple hundred thousand dollars of equity in that home. When she sells that home, she could end up paying a fair amount of money in capital gains tax. But by doing a 1031 tax deferred exchange, she can sell that home, roll the hundreds of thousands of dollars of equity into a new purchase here in our resort market and defer the capital gains to the new property. Meaning she's not going to have to pay the capital gains tax on the sale of the property in the location that's further away. And by doing this, you can do it legally through what is called a 1031 tax deferred exchange, essentially deferring the capital gains down the road.